this the place? Greetings, Witcher. It's nearby. Ready? Lead the way. Splendid. Come. The King of Beggars, man. His name is Tinboy. What do you know about him? Not much. He's easy to eye, so tread carefully. We need him far more than he needs us. You were to come alone, Elf. Who's this? A concerned friend. Ah. Fine. Here's how we see things. The boss at Loggerheads with Cleaver. There's got to be a payoff. We've got an offer, and it's non-negotiable. Surprise us. A steady supply of iron in exchange for 50% of your profits. Give you 25. Who are you to dictate anything to the King of Beggars? Oh, 35's as low as we'll go. Twenty-five's our limit. We'll throw in a discount at the shop. <laughs> You're clearly daft, Tramp. No deal. Come on, boys! Fine. We'll take your offer. But perhaps we should... You should go home, Elf. Agreed. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, tin boy. Too much drink. It softened your bloody mind. This here's Cleaver's territory, you prick whittler. Damn it. Who's this now? Cleaver's boys! Geralt, quickly! Stop, Rob, quick! Shut the gun! There could be more of them! Careful! There could be more in there! Follow me. Right. Sure hope there's a payoff at the end of this. So, supplies. That's something we can count on? Who'd you take me for? Gave you me word, didn't I? But I'd hire guards if I was you. You never know with Cleaver. Can you provide protection? A few of Cleaver's little shits escaped. Bugger probably already knows everything. I've no men to spare, can't guarantee your safety. If I was you, I'd lay low for a time. Thanks, Tin Boy. Down the line, the bosses will make a deal. You'll be left alone. All you gotta do is stay alive till then. <laughs> what now? Here we chat, while your partner's just flown the coop. Damn it. Hey, wait! <laughs> Good luck! Hattori. Wait! Seen a long ship from Skellinger in the hall. Wait, No chance. Leave me be. Don't be silly. Let me in. No, never. I shall stay in here until Middenvern. Forgive me, Geralt. That was a mistake. To parley with bandits, make deals. 
too late now. King of Beggars will get you supplies, and then what? You'll have to pay him. What have I done? Geralt, you must help me! No, I won't. I'm a Witcher, not a bodyguard. Precisely! You must find me a bodyguard! Geralt, I beg you! They'll kill me! Got anyone specific in mind? There's a mercenary, Sucrus. Often drinks at the Sturgeon. He's an old pirate, a Skelliger. He used to work for me. Huge as an oak. Wouldn't fear a dozen cleavers. Can't you talk to him yourself? We parted... not on the best of terms. That is to say, he demanded a bonus and I... Didn't pay him. Great. What now? Am I supposed to pay your dues? I'm certain you'll find some way to agree. Geralt, please don't leave me this way! Yes, I should interject. <clears throat> what the fuck are you doing? We weren't done conversing. Call that a conversation? Not your plowing business. You need a smack, is that it? Come on, come closer. Sorry, but you asked for it. I'm Geralt. Sucrus. You did well, mate. An ale to patch things. Come, we'll talk inside. What brings you here, Geralt? You and the merchant, what was that about? Uh, why my sis wedded that plow and rotter is beyond me. That was your brother-in-law? Prick-in-law, more like. Sweet talk me at first. Skellig a mead, we need barrels, we'll be rich men. So, I brought it in. Then he starts going on about unforeseen storage costs, net gross balances, and I don't know what else. Business and family just don't mix. Exactly, mate. Looking for a bodyguard. Interested? Why not? If there's coin in it. Well, there isn't. Not yet. So we're to barter. Favor for a favor, aren't we? I'm gonna kill you, Hattori. Yeah, I guess. What did you have in mind? My brother-in-law owes me some coin. Get it back and we'll talk. Do it. Where'll I find him? Nearby at the docks. You know what? I don't care for his coin all in all. If you don't get it back, I won't mind. So what do you want me to do? Smash his stock of mead. Was me brought it in from Aunt Skellig. That a mature thing to do? Nay, but it's fair. Greetings. I'm Mr. Sucrus's collector. Come to get... Mr. Sucrus, the man's a boar. 
I do not deal with illiterate peasants. Tell them I'll pay just as soon as palm trees sprout on Skellige. Palm trees have sprouted on Skellige. Now pay up. It can't be. Of course I shall pay Sucrus. A letter of credit acceptable? Redeemable at the Vivaldi's bank? Yes. I'm on my way. Took care of it. Trader said he'd give you a letter of credit issued by the Vivaldi's bank. Is that so? Well done, mate. So who am I to knock off? Just want you to keep an eye on someone. This swordsmith. Seems you know each other. I be your Hattori, the elf. Tried swindling me on axes once, the bastard. You working for him? You could say that. We're trying to dismantle the swordsmithing monopoly in Novigrad. Oh, noble cause. Well, you're vouching for him. Don't see why not. I'll grab some of the boys and we can go. Whitey, why'd your hair go white? The seas are tossing. Why is your hair so grey, darling? Black ones for Dalian. That will take You always wear tight Watch your trend. What's the hurry, my friend? That is so pretty, they can't keep his hands on this shell. Greetings, Satori. See, Sucrus already found you. You two agree to something? Yes, Geralt. I was forced to sell him a few axes at the wholesale price, but I was glad to do it. Thank you. Finally accepting orders for swords again? Sadly, no. I lack certain crafting supplies. Let me guess. Ernst van Horn's got a monopoly on them as well. Just so. He bought them cheap from sword makers abandoning the trade. Now he hoards them like a squirrel. But if you... No, you'd never agree. Agree to what? I happen to know where Van Horn keeps his hoard. It's more than he could possibly ever use. We could borrow a little. What are you getting me into? Borrow? Don't you mean steal? Stealing from a thief's no crime. It isn't? So what is it? Poetic justice? How did I get sucked into this? And why? It's simple. The best swords you've ever seen. Armor, trebuchet, catapults. All right, all right. Assuming I agree, how do you see this? Van Horn has his warehouse at the docks. The materials I need are very heavy. You must ask Sucrus to take his boys. Uh, one more thing. The crates I need will smell of ammonia. Greetings. Oh, Garrett. How are things? Hattori's got a job for us. Great. Well, he was starting to get bored. Wants us to borrow a few crates from Ernst Van Horn's warehouse. They'll smell of ammonia. Mm, sounds doable. I know where Van Horn stores his goods. The boys and I will go there, look around. Meet us near the Sturgeon. Fine. When? After dark, of course. See you there. Man, 
My nose ain't all that sensitive. I'll not find the right crates, so you gotta mark them with chalk. We'll get a cart in the meantime. Fine. What do I do when I'm done? Just leave the warehouse. Then we'll go in. Thieving swindler, I told you about. Are you following me, you scoundrel? Ah, plowing nonsense. I knows him. It's Witcher Geralt. How goes it, Master Witcher? A Witcher? Well, it all makes sense now. Mr. Dwarf, do not listen to him. The bastard will curse us. You trade hits with troll. A friend of Yap and Zigrin's a friend of mine. Now sod off for I lose my temper. Now! Abracadabra, hocus pocus. How goes it, Master Witcher? Anything specific you're looking for in Van Horn's warehouse? What I'm looking for is none of your business. Ought to just let me through. Way's all clear. Where are those crafting supplies? Does stink of ammonia. Must be it. That'd be it. Gotta signal them now. Have you any idea whose warehouse this is, goat fucker? Oi, Geralt. It's the bloke Atari told us about. The bugger who sleeps with Cleaver or something. Sucrus? Why are you here? With the sorcerer? Ah, now I see. That is one hell of a gesture you've pulled. Hattori sent you! That plowy non human will be sorry his mother didn't strangle him with his navel string. But first, we'll feed you to the crabs! Hands off my brother-in-law, swine! Only I can thrash him. Understood? Brother, let's mop the floor with these plowing Nordlings. Join us, Geralt! Adam! Give him here, Sucrus. Twirsa! with this fighter? Sucrus, forgive me. I love you like a brother, you unkempt bugger. Friends? Of course, friends. What good has Becker ever brought us? Where's that Dracker that hit me? Don't mean to spoil your reunion, but what'll we do with Van Horn? We'll take him to Stelliga before he comes too. Won't be any more trouble to you. And maybe we'll try a new venture. But first we have to move these crates to Hattori's. True. I had to pay him a visit too. Not a bad pay. Don't 
Greetings, Ivier. Geralt, you return safe and sound. I do. You doing all right? Never better. Once Van Horn had finally left, Cleaver lost interest in swordsmiths. I can forge swords again without fear of my workshop going up in flames. Glad to hear it. You've no notion how glad I am. I have no need of sucrus anymore and can devote myself to what I truly love. I thank you, Witcher. So now can you craft me something extraordinary? Naturally. It is what we agreed. Give me a few days, then come by for your new sword. <laughs> 